Taurus Jennifer from Abundance Amplified Tarot and more. Thank you for all of your support. What do we got going on for you? Wow. Out of the get gate, get go here. Out of the gate. I've got the page cups and a tower moment. Okay. So you guys are in the process of purging right now. You're in the process of having an opportunity to let go of what no longer serves you here. The opportunity to start brand new here and what is unexpected is all the love that you're receiving um i feel like you guys were were kind of tempering bringing in some heart space energy letting some new things in your life and then all of a sudden it's like you got smacked upside the head here okay spirit wants you to understand that it is helping you to discern what is not working for you and what is and the unexpected part of this as i said is I don't think you expected this outpouring of love to come in for you. Okay, coming up in the future here, you've got this Nine of Pentacles and this Seven of Pentacles. I feel like you guys have felt pretty overwhelmed and you need to understand that you're in the process of growing and expanding. Um, you are learning self-regulation here. Some of you could be manifesting a new partnership right now. Okay, and this is soulmate status. All right. This doesn't necessarily mean that you are manifesting a romantic partnership. For some of you, that's exactly what you're doing. Um, they want you to understand that your hardship is over here. Okay. The hardship is over. Justice is being done for you. There are going to be celebrations. They're encouraging you to get out in the world here to celebrate. I feel like I should shuffle these. Although I've got the lover's card that came up when I split the deck. Okay, some of you, um, this tower moment shook you to your core. You felt like even though you could have had a lot of things going on materially that you, like you couldn't find your footing. Okay, and it was, you went through some battles here, wow. Okay. When I asked what these battles were, you were completely out of balance. You lost your clarity here, okay? And this was your challenge. Your challenge was to see, okay, am I going to keep going the way I'm going or am I going to fix this? Okay, you got the clarity you needed. And I see like you have built a sanctuary around yourself, okay? Some of you could have um, done some major purging of habits and things that were really toxic for you okay uh and i feel like you're coming into wow yeah here comes the sun baby all right uh if this hasn't happened for you yet or if you don't know what i'm talking about keep the faith here um, I feel like some of you, again, you've got this nine of pentacles. You feel like you're content, but you still feel lacking here. Okay. Know that as you go along, some of this is just emotional residue. Okay. As you keep going, things are going to balance out. All right. Just keep taking care of yourself is what I'm getting. Some of you, um, Somebody could be bringing in an opportunity to you very shortly. Yeah, I've got self-love here. All right. The more you open up to love, the more opportunities are, are in front of you. Okay. And, and based in love. Yeah, this is about sacred space. Understanding that you are a sacred space in yourself. Okay. Um, really giving... value and gratitude for what you already have here in the present moment okay start where you are and grow i can't make this up i've got this dex version of the strength card again you have great courage and kindness you may not realize how strong and powerful you are but there's no problem you can't solve the compassion, now I want you to hear this, Taurus, the compassion you so freely give to others must also be given to yourself. I'm going to read that again. 
The compassion you so freely give to others must also be given to yourself. Stand strong in your convictions. If the right answer is to tell someone no. Okay. Uh, I've also got be open to success. So if you're in the process of doing one thing when you'd rather be doing something else, okay, or if you're with one person or one partner or one side of your business and you'd rather be doing something else, if you're not being honest about it, if you're not showing integrity, if you're not showing authenticity, then what happens is, is you're gumming up the works for everybody, right? Um, they want you <coughs> to know that it might seem like your life is going to start moving quickly, okay? So it's best to make sure that you have that, that balance already in place. A structure of balance is what I'm hearing. And that can come through, you know, healing practice. Uh, you know, get up in the morning and, you know, do meditation or prayer or, or some kind of movement, right? Get grounded in the morning. Uh, I've also been talking a lot now about the aura, the bio field, how that is part of our bodies and we need to take care of that. Learning how to do that would be very helpful for you because I think boundaries have been somewhat of an issue. And really, again, it's about forgiving yourself and taking care of yourself first and how that flows out into the world, all right? And I feel like you guys have the capacity here you've done it in the past Taurus you guys are leaders and you know when you start setting the example your whole world benefits okay the whole world around you benefits we've got queen of summer loving comforting emotional intuitive listen to your heart intuitive insights you can trust taking care of others perhaps a little too much right where are you in the scenario? I feel like I've been saying this for a long time, Taurus. Where do you fit in this scenario here? Okay. What about you? What else do we have for Taurus, please? Okay. Your hard work is paying off. Meditate and contemplate. You are good enough. Oh, there's another one back there. You are good enough, okay? Show the world the real you. Okay? I feel like you always, because you've been a leader and you've helped a lot of people, you feel like you have to maintain this facade and it's not the case at all. People love you for who you are and they'd like to get to know you better. Okay, internal chaos and conflict versus happy, happy. Okay, that internal chaos and conflict, notice how it's looking backwards. Okay, where the happy is looking to the future. Okay, notice the balance she's showing as she stands there. This is the choice for you, Taurus. This is the challenge. Okay, in God's hands, I like to say the divine or source. My trust in life is implicit. Divine's greater knowing and greatest love guide my heart and my choices. My faith is steady. I remain true to my light. Everything unfolds according to divine timing and divine will. Our higher selves here. Okay, you have to have faith. Notice the red, orange, and yellow root sacral and solar plexus chakras, okay, grounding, right? This will affect your confidence, okay? We also have wisdom here. The divine has a plan for me. I live here now knowing beauty is to come. I don't force things to happen faster than the universe has decided for me. I learn from my experiences, take small steps in faith, and succeed thanks to all my efforts, okay? Okay. And open to the universe. I'm discovering my worth and my abilities. I have value. I have confidence in my value and potential. Okay. What I want you to see here. What spirit wants you to see here. Is this green heart energy. The sanctuary card. That green heart space energy. Okay. Please take good care of yourselves out there. All right. Taurus, I hope this has been helpful. 
Take good care of yourself, take good care of others, and as always, and start with yourself first. Be kind out there.